Kia ora everybody. Uh, my name is Danny Beddingfield. Um, um, up till the end of last year I was based in Christchurch and I am now I have moved back to Wellington and I live in a, a small area called Titahi Bay in Wellington. Uh, this video really is kind of a follow-up update to some uh, video updates I did last year based around uh, Movember and my health. So I thought I'd uh, owe it to a lot of my friends and people who've been following me to uh, post a little bit of an update here. I first got involved in Movember actually in 2007 was my first go at Movember uh, quite a while ago now and um, at the time I was working as a teacher in a school and I managed to raise around about 80 or 90 dollars which I thought was quite good and had a bit of fun growing a mo and um, yeah had, had, had a good time doing it. I didn't really think too much more of it um, until in around about ooh, two years later uh, my father actually contacted me and uh, told my sister and I that he had been diagnosed with prostate cancer. And up till about uh, at the beginning of 2013, he actually lost his battle. So he had a five-year battle with, with prostate cancer. And obviously that uh, spurred me a bit more into action and obviously gave me a lot more knowledge around what prostate cancer was and uh, some of the treatments involved with it. So my plan was always in 2013 to get heavily involved in Movember, uh, to grow a, a whopping mo and to raise as much money and awareness as I possibly could uh, in the honour, I guess, of my father. What actually happened though during 2013 means the story took a pretty significant turn. Uh, during that year, um, I took a, um, a blood test, a PSA blood test, purely to keep my, my mother happy. As she said, uh, you need to go and get checked. I was 37 at the time. Um, and I didn't think much of it. I had a check done early in 2013 and I was asked to come back in six months time to have another check done. So life carried on as normal and I started up my um, Movember campaign and was doing very, very well. Uh, lots of great, great friends and people I didn't even know contributing and it ended out that I actually um, came up with $4,330 in 2013 raise, which is, is, is outstanding and I think put me about fourth in New Zealand. However, what happened in early November, about a couple of days before my birthday, uh, the second results, the blood test came in and, and the uh, results of another uh, um, another procedure as well. And it turned out that I had been diagnosed also with prostate cancer. Um, and they have a scale of talking about how, um, I guess, how progressive it is. And mine was a 7 out of 10 or how aggressive. It was a 7 out of 10. So it was reasonably aggressive. And the best options at the time from the doctors uh, were to um, have my prostate taken out. And luckily I had... Um, medical insurance so I was able to do that uh, robotically um, and that was taken out in late November so all of this happened during my November campaign which I think probably contributed to my popularity and uh, and money raised there which was, was fantastic but that's been a pretty amazing journey um, a pretty hard journey as well and I must say that uh, having your prostate out is not you know something that you want to have done but I was very very lucky that we caught it so early um, normally people around my age would not have gone off and had a test so um, that's something that I've been trying to promote to people um, during the course of my uh, Movember campaigns. So at the moment, um, I'm you know in reasonably good health. I must say, I'm, I uh, still I guess I am still recovering from the operation. This is about three months on now, almost four months on, and uh, there's still little things that are going on. And I, you know I'm always going to have some certain issues because I. Uh, because I have had my prostate out, but you know that is certainly the lesser of, of many evils, and uh, a lot of people battle prostate cancer for a long, long time. Uh, I guess Movember, in a way, gave me the power to get my message out even further. Um, I have a, have, a, have a big message I tell people: you know, get the test. It's really important that you know if you have any family history of any types of cancer, um, because that you know certainly puts you more at risk. And you know, the message I was putting out there was that if you know you have family history of some kind, then you really need to go and get checked from about the age of forty. Um, and if you have got a family history there may be a bit later 45 to 50 but it is really important that people take control of their their you know their own health in fact you know sometimes people will say oh if I get cancer it's you know it's, it's part of the lottery it's not you know that that side of our health is not part of a lottery don't make it a lottery it is up to you to get yourself checked and, and that's a really important message to get out there especially in New Zealand here we have a lot of um, the typical Kiwi male unfortunately is not sort of someone who tends to go to the doctor just to get checked they tend to go to the doctor only to uh, you know when they've got something wrong with them so that's the message we're trying to get out there and, and this year you know 2014 I will be running Movember again I will grow another beautiful moustache and you know and raise a little bit of money but it's, it's more about getting that message out there be responsible for your own health get out there get checked spread the message it, you know it doesn't have to be anything to be ashamed of it's really important that people do that and, and get out there and do you know get out there and get the test and Movember is a great way to do that it's a great month it's a, it's a month of solidarity between other males and yourselves um, you know it's, it's fantastic to grow that mo you get away with it for a month your wives don't mind too much 
might do, your partners don't mind, and um, I would certainly recommend getting involved with Movember in any way that you possibly can. So uh, ka kite anō, um, have a fantastic uh, year, and I really do hope to see a lot of you getting involved in Movember this year. Take care. <laughs>